What's up, guys? We are back at the video. Today, we're watching Season 5, Episode 8 of Game of Thrones. Um, I know a bunch of people in the comments were saying I should watch, um, like, Season 1 lore videos. And uh, I was going to watch it Wednesday, but I watched, like, the first, like, minute of it, and it felt like it, it was, like, too spoil spoilery, even for, like, Season 1. So I was, like, kind of hesitant on watching it. Um, I usually like to get my lore from, like, the show while I'm watching it, because that's kind of how, like, the author intended, or the director, I guess, in this case. But, um, if you guys really want me to watch it, I can watch it. I can also watch it at the end of Game of Thrones, of the series, and we can kind of, like, go back to see, what, like, what I missed, or kind of, like, fill in the gaps. Um, we will see. If you guys really want me to watch it, I'll watch it. It's also, like, I wouldn't say boring, but, like, I could watch, like, a three-hour video, like, a lore video about, like, some video game character, like, League of Legends or something like that. And it's super fun, but, like, as soon as, like, you try to, like, record something, it feels like homework. So, it doesn't feel like I'm watching, like, a lore video. It feels like I'm, like, doing lore homework, which is, like, the worst. If I'll... I'll, uh, if you guys want me to watch it though, I'll watch it. It's not that big of a deal, but um, yeah, you know, let's get in the show. I could do an even better job advising a ruler worth the name, if that is indeed what you are. Okay, I fuck with it. So you want to advise me? Very well. What would you have me do with him? I swore I would kill him if he ever returned. I know. That's why you need to kill him. Why should the people trust a queen who can't keep her? Homie promise? is about to turn into a rock. Anyway, so it doesn't even matter. Wait. Was when he Dwayne the Rock the youth, Johnson. No longer that man. Homie's about to. <laughs> I can't remember ever seeing a sane man. Homie's about to turn into a rock. He is to serving you. He claims right. he would kill for you and die for you. He's gonna turn into the Nothing rock, people. gives me reason to doubt him. And yet he did betray you. Oh, shit. Did he have an opportunity to confess his betrayal? Yes. Many opportunities. And did he? No. Not until forced to do so. He worships you. He is in love with you, I think. But he did not trust you with the truth. An unpleasant truth, to be sure, but one of great significance to you. He did not trust that you would be wise enough to forgive him. So I should kill him. A ruler who kills those devoted to her is not a ruler who inspires devotion. Banish him. Going to need to inspire devotion. A lot of Send him back to the rock I people. Going to rule across the narrow sea. But you cannot have him by your side when you do. Remove Sejora from the city. Hey, little dude. Later. Back to the stone people. Wait a minute. I don't know why I'm getting these like memories, dude. Like these uh it's like the episode of SpongeBob, bro. Like where like Squidward. I'll put like a picture if you guys know this, but like Squidward. And he like and there's like a sewer or something like that. And they they go in and he like uh he, he's like with the stone people and they have like a leaf coming out of their mouth. I'll put a picture so you guys know. But like it's like, oh my god. He's gonna turn into like one of those like, those like dude, it's like, dude, I, it's exactly like the episode of Spongebob. I swear to god. I will put up a picture for you guys, but dude. Is 
Is that soup or water? What is that? Fish. I found it. Let me speak to them. Damn. Fish. I meant it. My face will be the last thing you see. Damn. What the fuck? Bro, my mom used to hit my bro my older brother and sister with like a wooden spoon when they were <laughs> when they were acting out. <laughs> I never got I never got the hit with the spoon. I was a good boy. My name is Lana. I'm an orphan. This was, was like years ago when the like hitting your child was like okay. But um that Yeah, my brother got the spoon. Money to buy two more. It took a while, but I finally saved enough to buy myself an oyster cart. Now every morning I make my way down to the canals. Is this like um imagination training or whatever where it's like and the bakers to be the person you want to like shape shift into you have to like act like that person you like think like that person or like you know be that person I turn left onto moon singer lane turn left onto Ragman lane where I do most of my trade oh no it's very impressive very industrious. She will make a fine servant for the many-faced god. How will she serve him? She will no longer turn left onto Ragman Lane. She will turn right and go to Ragman Harbor. What will she do there? She will see. See what? How can a man tell a girl this? If he knew what she would see, there would be no reason to send her. Oysters, crabs, and cockles! I'm freezing. Bro, what was that? It was like the flattest bread ever. Oyster clads and cuckolds? Cuckolds? Is that what you said? You wouldn't lie to an old man, would you? That guy's rich. Dude, I hate oysters, man. I've never had an oyster, and I don't think I ever will. Very nice. I'd rather... Before. I'm happy Good dying, minute. never eating an oyster in my life. It's my 18th voyage. Returned from all of them without a scratch on me. Says you didn't know what I'd see at the docks. A man had no idea what a girl would see and what she would not. So if the gambler keeps the money, a girl named Lana will return to the docks. They send. She will watch the gambler. She will come someone to the from the many faced gods to kill him. I... And then what? I'm confused. A gift for the thin man. Oh shit, is she gonna do is this like okay so they did they just do imagination training? Like, hey this is how like they played it in their head Not first ready. and now she's gonna go do it? Like she's gonna like she next episode or maybe not. like later this episode. She's not? Is she gonna pretend to be the, the, the oyster face. seller and then kill the the gambler? Oh my god. Dude, my fucking nose itches. The trial will take place, so the High Sparrow will be presenting a substantial case against you. The charges? Fornication, treason, incest, the murder incest. of King Robert. Holy oh, shit. Of course, Your Grace. Those are some hefty charges, my god. That shit's life in, my concern life in prison. is that the faith does not adhere to the same standards of proof as the crown. I hope you'll excuse me for saying it, but belief is so often the death of reason. I wish you'd said it sooner. Is there any word from Jamie? 
No, I'm afraid not. No, Jamie, no one's here to save you, homie. You start this problem, your now you're gonna sit in jail. Grand Maester Pycelle has summoned your uncle Kevin back from Casterly Rock to serve the hand of the king. He now presides over the small council. Tell him I need to speak to him. I implored him to visit you, but he would not. What about my son, the king? If you can visit me, then surely the king... Your arrest and Queen Marjorie's arrest, the king has not taken them well. He remains in his chambers. His servants often find his food in the hall, left under. Dude, Tommen's such you a fucking beta male. You need to talk to my son and tell Homie is fucking a soy him. boy. I tried, Your Grace. He wouldn't see me. He won't see anyone. I can't stay. There is a way. A Rika snitch, though, for real. Why? Why, Theon? Not Theon. There is no Theon. Reek. Reek. Why did you tell him Reek? I was helping you. You wanted to escape. There is no escape. Not ever. Theon Greyjoy tried to escape. The master knew. He knows everything. He hunted him and caught him and strapped him to a cross. He cut away piece after piece until there was no Theon left. Bro, you just gotta. Good. You just gotta, like. What well, if you just strip away at Reek until there's nothing but for you, I'd Theon left? The family. You just, you just do, I do the do reverse. What Ramsey did to you right here, right now, I would. I deserved every. You've known them since they were born. They, they were lonely. Only what? Say it, Reek. I can't. Tell me. I can't. Not unless the master. Say it. Tell me they weren't what. They weren't. Tell Say me it, why Reek. Bran and Rickon should be gone while you still breathe the air. Tell me to my face, Theon. Tell me that they weren't your brothers. They weren't Bran and Rickon. Couldn't find them. These two farm boys. Too bad Bran and Recon aren't in this season, so. I killed them and burned them so no one would know. You didn't? Do you know they live, Brandon. they're somewhere. I can't talk to you anymore. Theon, you have to tell me. They're with like some idea. random Theon, dude Reek. in the woods, like super far north with the White Walkers. Our scouts tell us he's got. You are, father. I think you're missing an opportunity to show the people of the north how House Bolton treats southern invaders. And what do you recommend? That we not sit and wait for Stannis to decide what sort of fight this is going to be, but we hit first and hit hard. And leave a feast for the crows. Nah, the smart Ramsay is fucking stupid. Defensive advantage. Damn straight. As long as we stay behind these walls, they can't touch us. Not to mention that the snow is so deep we couldn't get an army through to engage them even if we wanted to. I don't need an army. I need 20 good men. No, Ramsay, suck my dick. No way. You're taking out an uh, taking out an army with twenty men. Yeah, you're fucking stupid. So have you decided? Actually, Ramsey, go ahead and do I'm it. I hope Ramsey gets fucking kidnapped, and then they you use him as a fucking bargaining to tool to, to like I don't know, fuck some shit up. I can see why you would think so. It's what your father would have done. And what would your father have done? My father publicly sentenced me to death. I'd say his thoughts on having me killed were abundantly clear. Is that why you killed him? Someday, if you decide not to execute me, I'll tell you all about why I killed my father. And on that day, should it ever come, you'll need more wine than this. Ah, uh, yes. Bonding over daddy was. issues. What he did. 
I know the Mad King earned his name. No? Banish me? No. So if I'm not going to be murdered and I'm not going to be banished... You're going to advise me. While you can still speak in complete sentences. Come on, bro. Advise you on what? How to get what I want. The Iron Throne. Perhaps you should try wanting something else. If I want jokes, I'll get myself a proper fool. I'm not entirely joking. There's more to the world than Westeros, after all. How many hundreds of thousands of lives have you changed for the better here? Perhaps this is where you belong, where you can do the most good. I fought so that no child born into Slaver's Bay would ever know what it meant to be bought or sold. I will continue that fight here and beyond. Okay. But this is not my home. When you get back to your home, who supports you? The common people. Let's be generous and assume that's going to happen. Here in Slaver's Bay, you had the support of the common people and only the common people. What was that like? Ruling without the rich. House Targaryen is gone. Not a single person who shares your blood is alive to support you. The Starks are gone as well. Our two terrible fathers saw to that. The remaining members of House Lannister will never back you, not ever. Stannis Baratheon won't back you either. His entire claim to the throne rests on the illegitimacy of yours. That leaves the Tyrells. Not impossible. Not enough. Lannister, Targaryen, okay, Baratheon, okay. Stark, Tyrell. They're all just spokes on a wheel. This one's on top, then that one's on top, and on and on it spins, crushing those on the ground. It's a beautiful dream. Stopping the wheel. You're not the first person who's ever dreamt it. I'm not going to stop the wheel. I'm gonna make it roll faster. I'm going to break the wheel. Oh god, no. I mean, uh, Tyrion's got a point. Even with, like, a massive army and three dragons going up versus the Tyrells, Lannisters. Fuck, maybe even the Boltons, too. You said whoever wins will fight to the great pit in front of the queen. I won. You struck me. Have me flogged. If it makes you happy, I'm the best you've got. If I win at the great pit, can you sell me for? We're a free man. You could have gone anywhere. Why did you come back? He's... Because he's dying. Let me fight for her. And I belong to you. This guy is a fucking simp. Oh my god, man. He is dying and he's like, Let me fight for my queen. Please, dude. Anything. Like, bro, get just fucking like chop off your arm or something. Become like Jamie. Like that shit is like slowly spreading. You're not even like it's just gonna take like a month. Confess. Whole... I forgot how just big this place is. My God, how are they gonna fit all these people on these on these tiny boats? Oh shit! Okay, never mind. <laughs> Ignore my dumbass. My name's Jon Snow. I'm Lord Commander of the Night's Watch. We're not friends. We've never been friends. We won't become friends today. This isn't about friendship. <clears throat> this is about survival. This is about putting a 700 foot wall between you and what's out there. You built that wall to keep us out. Since when do the claws give two shits if we live? In normal times, we wouldn't. But these aren't normal times. The White Walkers don't care if a man's free folk or crow. We're all the same to them. Meat for their army. But together, 
we can beat them. Yeah, imagine it. The imagine the White Walkers got a hold of every Run single person in this fucking village. It's like a trillion people. The long night is coming, and the dead come with it. No clan can stop them. The Free Folk can't stop them. The Night's Watch can't stop them, and all the Southern Kings can't stop them. Only together. All of us. And even then, it may not be enough, but at least we'll give the fuckers a fight. Dude, imagine how strong zombies would be in an army, though. Like... They don't need to sleep and they don't need to eat. Dude, they could like raid your base for 27 hours. You vouch for this man. <clears throat> I'm so paranoid of my recording. That's why I keep on looking over here, by the way. Dude, I've, I fucked it up so many times. It's fucking, it's ridiculous. Like I'm so paranoid at this point. <clears throat> so it looks like half the tribe is coming, half the tribe is staying. It looks like the tribe staying like is gonna fucking die, I guess. I don't know. Five thousand. I'm not good at counting. <clears throat> We're leaving too many behind. The free folk are stubborn. You know how long it took man's to band them together? Twenty fucking years. Many knew them better than I ever will. They're running out of food, and there's nothing to hunt. What you gotta do is you gotta come around. Yeah, I was gonna say you just gotta wait like maybe like five more days. Gonna look after you. She's in charge. You listen to her. I want to go with you. I need to get the old folks on the boats. I'm right behind you, I promise. Go on. Why was that so sweet? They're gonna, like, I feel like they're gonna die now. There's gonna be, like, a sea serpent or. Sh I was gonna say a shark, but I don't think there's sharks here. An orca? Orcas are live in the cold, right? What is going on? Is this a storm? An avalanche. This is a jump scare. Oh, you're dead. That water is so cold, that's a like game over. Homie screaming, get in line. I'm gonna call them zombies because Weight Walkers is too complicated. Like, it's too many fucking words, you know what I mean? They are destroying this wood like it's butter. Come on, Commander! Get them to the ship and come back for me! Will you listen now? 
They need to like, I know it's not plausible, but they might want to bring a big ship over here, you know what I mean? It might take a hot minute. You should build one of those boats! So should you! But like the girls got on. They're gonna let them pass the wall even if you're not there. You have my word. I'll give an order. Oh Don't shit. Think you're gonna be there to enforce those orders. True, that is a good point. If he's not they get through, everyone dies. True. I'm still confused of how these guys turn into zombies so quickly. Like, the mist came and it was just silence. It's <laughs> like they got him so hard. The Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse. Is that what that's supposed to be? Like the four, like, uh... Is that like a, like a thing? That guy turns into a zombie. I'm gone. And by the way, like I'm, 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 I'm dipping. Main boss, boss fight. Boss fight, here we go. Get the glass. Oh, he's fucking dead. Hey, he's dead. Oh, fuck, he's so dead. This, this white walk. Not even a fight. This White Walker has been alive for 500 years. He studied the arts of fucking <laughs> like martial arts for years. Jon Snow, you got this. Am I right? This guy's a fucking badass. My God. He's not even in his final form yet, dude. This this guy right here. This guy definitely has like three phases. This guy definitely has like three phases right here. Wait, what? Silver! Is that a silver sword? That White Walker looks surprised when, um. Oh, no, this is the main boss right here. This. <laughs> This guy has two phases, dude. The other. <gasps> oh. That is sick. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh. Oh. Hey. 
dude, zombie, dude, there's like very little shows that like killed, chil killed children. And that was fucking cool. I think there was like, in, in The Walking Dead, there was only like one zombie kid, I think. Oh yeah, you gotta fucking dip. Oh, I love it. Dude, as a kid, I used to be scared of zombies. How is this big dude gonna get in into a boat? I still don't know how if these I don't think this works like zombies. I don't think it takes a bite. I think it takes like magic. This guy's fucking a badass. He's like made- I noticed this too. He's like made out of glass, like ice, while the other ones are made out of, um, like bone and flesh. Which is, I find, very interesting. What the fuck is he doing? What the fuck is he doing? No. Um, um, uh, yeah, you guys are fucked. You guys are beyond fucked. You guys are so fucked, it's like ridiculous. They probably net like 5,000 people right there, they're like net positive. Um, yo, one guy with an arrow, and that, that guy's dead, that White Walker, by the way. You just need, like, one dude with, like, an arrow. Oh, good episode. I think that was, like, the best episode we've ever had so far. Pause. Exit. I think that was the best episode we've seen. My god. Oh, okay, so I, that got that answers my question. Is it's not like these zombies. Are, it, it doesn't take a bite. It just takes this. That, this guy just did, did this. He did this, and they all came to life. So it's not you don't. It's not a bite. It's definitely magic. One hundred percent guaranteed magic. Now the real question is, how deep does this magic go? Right. Like, is it only that one dude? Or is it like the four people of the apocalypse? Because there was like four horsemen. And I think that's supposed to represent like... That's like a metaphor, right? Like the four... You know what I mean? So is it all four of these guys can like uh, res people? And how do you make... Like I, the, like the... How do I put this? Like those guys look like they're made, made of ice. And the other zombies look like they're made of like bone and flesh. So there's, there's got to be like some type of different resurrection type, you know, magic going on. 
we still don't know what happens with the babies because the babies were all alive, right? So I wonder if that's how you make like the glass zombies and those guys can like resurrect the dead. Oh. Mm. Interesting. Mm. This itches my brain. Um. Good thing Jon Snow showed up the day he did because if he didn't, if he was like five minutes late, even like an hour late, everyone was dead. That is some, some good timing. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Later, peace.